back, adventurers. This is Ja Weddle, and this is Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. Let's talk to Malan. Are you going to the castle, fairy boy? Would you mind finding my dad? He must have fallen asleep somewhere around the castle. He's such a doofus. Uh. Oh, excuse me. Oh, if you'll look for him, I'll give this to you. It's some Tums. Because you burp all the time. I've been incubating this egg very carefully. Tee hee. Alright. You got a weird egg. Feels like there's something moving inside of it. It's a dinosaur. Welcome to Jurassic Park. Cool. Alright, so it's daytime. So, we can climb these vines now. Look at that beautiful sky up there. There shouldn't be a guy. Wait a minute. Why is a guy here? What is he doing? Oh, maybe he's already off, always there. Whoa. I don't know. I feel like these guys are... Uh, let's see what happens. Yeah. Metal Gear Ocarina of Time. Ninja in that. Little butterflies floating beside the bush there. There's a secret. If you can get the Deku stick out, and like, if you get, just kind of hover around the butterflies, eventually if they follow you, one will turn into a fairy. And, uh, that can be very useful. I'm gonna jump down here and swim. There's some guards to our right, so you have to believe me on that. Some invisible rupees here in the water. We'll pick them up. Alright. Look at this freaking awesome polygon castle, man. I just love it. Who's this big doofus? <laughs> what a weirdo. Alright, well, we got something for him. Somewhere. Oh, there he is. He's in a weird spot. And oh, this doesn't look like it works here. What? It doesn't work here. How does it not work here? Where does it work? Does it work right here? Oh no! When does our egg hatch? Do we have to let a whole night go by? Maybe. See, I think it's funny. I think I. Yeah, weird. I guess, like, the whole missing the bridge and everything throws up your day-night cycle off. Because here I am, not being able to hatch my egg and wake him up. Oh, well. Uh. Just got to do some burps and stuff until then. I guess we could move these crates around a little bit while we're waiting. While you were sleeping. We moved crates around. Big crates with a big cow head on it. Undoubtedly, these are from Lon Lon Ranch. Contain tons of milk. If Blink would just break into one of these crates, he could have enough milk for the rest of the game. Wouldn't have to buy any milk at all. But that wouldn't be very moral, now would it? Alright, well, we're pretty much set on these crates. And this guy... Well, uh, he can't wake up. I mean, what kind of disease does this guy have where he just doesn't ever stop sleeping? He's been sleeping for two days, basically. It's done went through a day and night cycle twice. And it'll keep going forever and ever. Until I play the chicken sound for him. Crazy old man. Crazy old man. Oh, goodness. Yeah, this game looks great for my... Oh, look, a chicken hatched from the egg. Nice. This game looks great on my TV through the progressive scan mode, I'm telling you. I don't know how it looks on the uh, Wii U, because this is now on the virtual console. 
So maybe it's just as equally good, but... Wow, what in tarnation? Can't a person get a little shut out around here? No, get out of the way. Hello, who might you be? Yep, I'm Town, the owner of Line Line Ranch. I went to the castle to deliver some of the milk, but I sat down here and rest, and I guess I just fell asleep for six days. What? Malin was looking for me? I'm gonna catch it from her now. She probably thought I was dead because he sleeps for six days. Oh boy, she's really gonna let me have it. Ah, just run the whole way, flailing my arms like a crazy man. All right, cool. Uh, phew, geez, Louise. Some people, man. Some people. Yeah, I mean, it, like I said earlier, if, you, if you're gonna play the game, I, I highly encourage you to pick this version up. Uh, it's on GameCube. You get the original game and the Master Quest version, and you can buy it for 40, 50 bucks. It might seem like a lot, but this is a classic. If you're really into this game, like I said, I think this is a, the definitive version to play. Now, I haven't seen the the Wii U. Uh, version. Maybe that's just fine. Maybe that's great. I don't know. Get up there, dude. Whee! Crawl through here. Don't suffocate. And Link's like <laughs> choking on the water the entire way there. Yeah, you gotta come in here at night. If you don't, man, these guards will be all up in your grill. You're not gonna want that. This is like... The only area of the entire game you gotta be stealthy. You never have to do this again. So, if this is your first time watching this game. Like I said, congratulations. Welcome to a great series. But don't be scared by this thing, thinking, "Oh man, I don't have to sneak around and stuff." This is dumb. I think this is fun because, like I said, this is the only time you ever have to do this. That's probably what makes this game so neat. It's got a bunch of little neat things like this in it. Maybe I shouldn't say a bunch, but it's got some for sure. Roll, Link. Roll. Don't roll into bushes. Go, you dummy. You big doof head. And just don't mind me. I'm just gonna... There we go. I think I got caught last time up here. These guys right here walk in tandem. There's another one. Where the heck's he at? I don't see him. There he is. Yeah, I think I went right there. Or maybe that's the way you actually want to go. Wow, he, the guy up there just covered some distance. Go, doof head. Oh, no, no, no. I should have went. I see. Yeah, you don't want to go now. Or maybe you do. Maybe I'm just messing this up. Oh, well. Here we go. This is definitely the way. Get up there, Link. Come on. Don't mind me. And who could be out here in this courtyard? Let's see the epicness of this right here. Beautiful music playing. There can only be one person right there. Oh, hold on, we gotta check something out. Look at that. Look at that Mario and Prince's poster in there. This was in the original version. They took this out and there's a uh, Yoshi. They took that out in the 3DS version. And I think if you throw something in there, like you'll get rupees or something comes out of it. I'm not really sure, not gonna mess around too much. Oh, this heat is coming out of the vent and killing my eyes here. Who? Who are you? How did you get past the guards? Uh, easily. <laughs> oh, what's that? Is that? Is that a bug? Ah! She just like squashes it and kills Navi. Then you are. You're from the forest. Oh, then you wouldn't happen to have the spiritual stone of the forest, would you? That green and shining stone? I really want it. 
please. Ah, uh, just as I thought. I had a dream, and in the dream I stole the spadone from a bully that came from the forest. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, in the dream, dark storm clouds were billowing over the land of Hyrule. But suddenly, a ray of light shot down from out of the forest, parted the clouds, and lift and lit up the ground. Oh God, well, I can't read. I can't read. The light turned into a figure holding a green and shining stone, followed by a fairy. I know this is a prophecy that somehow that I know this is a prophecy that someone would come from the forest. What? That just reads weird. Yes, I thought you might be the one. Oh, I'm sorry. I got carried away with my story and didn't even properly introduce myself. I am Zelda, Princess of Hyrule. What is your name? Weenus. That's a weird name. Strange. It sounds somehow goofy. Okay then, Weenus. I'm going to tell you the secret of the sacred realm that has been passed down for the royal family. By the royal family. For the royal family. Please keep it a secret from everyone. Oh god, if I have to. Legend goes like this. It was a legend, and it was great. Three goddesses hid the trifles containing the power of the gods somewhere in Hyrule. The power to grant the wish of one who holds the trifles in his hands, in his hands. If someone with the righteous heart makes that wish, it will bleed. Hyrule to a golden age of prophecy. If someone with an evil mind has wish you to regret it, the world will come to by evil. That is what is said. So the ancient sages built the temple of time to protect the trifles from evil ones. <laughs> Oh, sorry. That's right. The Temple of Time is the entrance through which you can enter the sacred realm from our world. But the entrance is sealed with a stone wall called the Door of Time. <laughs> Fucking convenient. And in order to open the door, it is said that you need to collect three spiritual stones. And another thing you need is a key. The Ocarina of Time. Did you understand well the story I just told you? Sure. That's great! Everybody always thinks I'm crazy when I tell that story. I'm spying through this window just now. The other element from my dream, the dark clouds, I believe they symbolize that man in there. Will you look through the window at him? Yeah. I don't know what happens when you say no and I want to look through. I love this scene. see Ganondorf before he like you know has made his move has played his cards can you see the man with the evil eyes that is Ganondorf the leader of the Gerudos they hail from the desert far to the west though he swears allegiance to my father I'm sure he is not sincere the dark clouds that covered Hyrule in my dream they must symbolize that man What happened? Did he see you? Don't worry. He doesn't have any idea what we're planning yet. Why would she say that? It's like, you think he will. Yes, I told my father about my dream. However, he didn't believe it was a prophecy. But I can sense that the man's evil intentions. My father is a doofus. What Ganondorf is after must be nothing less than the Triforce in the Sacred Realm. He must have come to Hyrule to obtain it, and he wants to conquer Hyrule. No, the entire world. Wait, where's the rest of the world if it's not in Hyrule? I don't see anything. Anyway, Weenus, now we are the only ones who can protect the Hyrule. The world Hyrule. Hyrule world, okay. Thank you. I do like that, and I love this shot, how it zooms in off the, after that flower. I'm afraid I have a feeling that that man is going to destroy, destroy Hyrule. 
He has such terrifying power, but it's fortunate that you have come. We must not let Ganondorf get the Triforce. And then, like, Ganondorf is right inside the window, just, like, tapping the glass, like, I hear you out there. <laughs> I will protect the Ocarina of Time with all my power. He shall not have it. It's hidden under my bed right now. He'll never get it. You go get the other two spiritual stones. Let's get the Triforce before Ganondorf does, and then defeat him. One more thing. Take this letter. I'm sure it'll be helpful to you. You got Zelda's letter. Wow, it's even got her autograph on it with little lipstick kiss. That's crazy. She's like a celebrity. You'll never part without it. All right, we're done. My attendant will guide you out of the castle. Don't be afraid to talk to her. I'm afraid. So let me get this straight. The only way that Ganondorf can succeed is if he gets into the Sacred Realm. And we're going to go get the things to open the Sacred Realm to defeat him. To make sure he doesn't succeed. Don't you see a problem here, Zelda? I am Empa of the Sheikahs. I am responsible for protecting Princess Zelda. Everything is exactly as the princess foretold. You are a courageous boy. You are heading out on a big new adventure, aren't you? My role as the princess's dream was to teach a melody to the one from the forest. This is an ancient melody passed down by the royal family. I have played this song for the princess Zelda as a lullaby ever since she was a baby. There is a mysterious power in these notes. Now listen carefully and get ready to play this song about a hundred times during this game. It's probably not that many times, but you do play it quite a bit. But that's kind of the magic and neatness to this game, is playing on the ocarina and playing these songs. They do have beautiful melodies. It's kind of hard to hear because my audio is in a delay. So I, like, I started hitting the buttons and I was like, what's going Oh, yeah. Whoa, dude. Look at that surprise Link face. He's like, holy crap. There's something going on with my ocarina. It's sparkling. He just runs out. Like, he's just so scared. Ah! He just runs right past the info. If the castle soldiers find you, there will be trouble in the castle. Let me lead you out. Whoosh. Instant warp scene. Gotta love it. She's a ninja. She could do that kind of thing. And you're about to see even more ninja stuff right here. You brave lad. We protect this beautiful land of Hyrule. Death Mountain looming in the distance. Take a look at that. That's Death Mountain. I just said that. Home of the Gorons. They hold the spiritual stone of fire. At the foot of Death Mountain, you will find my village, Kakariko. That is where I was born and raised. You should talk to someone of the villagers Duh. before you go up Death Mountain. Ugh. Mm. The song I just taught you is, has some mysterious power. Only royal family members are allowed to learn the song. Remember, it will help you prove your connection with the royal family. The princess is waiting for you to return to the castle with the stones, alright? Counting on you. Watch out! She knows doing one of those little snaps that you used to buy at the dollar store, and she's out of there. Does anyone know, remember those snaps? They're crazy. Those snaps were crazy. All right, so I'm having a premonition. Oh wait. First of all, my premonition is that I don't remember these songs. Wait, where are my songs at? So it's lullaby. Oh, I don't have sorry a song yet. It's just, <laughs> so she tells me to go to Kakariko and do stuff. And then once I go there, stuff's gonna happen and I'm gonna go and talk to some Gorons, but then I'm gonna get to a guy that's all like Yo, I don't care much for you. And, uh... And we're gonna be stuck. And we're gonna be like, dude, what, what's this guy's problem, man? We're cool, we're good. And he's not, he's not gonna wanna say anything to us, so... 
We're gonna head back to Kakari er, Kokiri Forest Village. And we're gonna go see an old friend. I think she can help us. Um, so we're gonna go do that, and I'll see you in the next part of Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. Meet you there. Thanks for watching.